Hey, 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 guys. What's up? It is your friend, Victor, here. And today we're going to do sketch car today. Exciting, no? All right. Sorry, I'm like eating some chips here. I was running a few minutes behind schedule because I had to grab some water. So yeah, today we have one commission, then we're going to do free drawing. I'm grabbing some water. If you haven't tuned in before, uh, usually once every weekday, once around 4 p.m., I open up a window into my drawing studio, do some live commissions, chat with you guys. Um, if you're not catching this live on Facebook at facebook.com slash victor moreno you're looking at this on youtube at youtube.com slash c slash cult classics if you hear me uh talking to myself that's because when people ask questions in the live comments i answer them live so that's what's gonna go on here and today we're gonna do he manny which is the G garbage pale kids version of he man so that should be fun all right, so somebody's in here now, so I'll say hey. Again, the app's not telling me who it is, but it's all good. I got some uh, water, and I got some uh, potato chips, so I'm going to get into some drawing. Uh, so, yeah, let's get on this guy, because I've never drawn this character before. He looks cute. It's basically Garbage Pail Kids He-Man, um, so he should be fun to color, actually. I like the ones that are fun to color. So I'll say hey to you two guys that are watching. Doesn't say who your names are. Three guys that are watching. But yeah, we're going to have some fun. Booyah. Not boo -nah. All right. Let's see here. Do the He-Man hairdo. Push this up a little bit. There we go. All right. Oh, my glasses are a little dirty. The eternal struggle of cleaning your glasses. Here we go. All right. I need to sharpen these tomorrow. All right, here we go. I do want to thank everybody who's been, uh, you know, getting artwork and prints and stuff from the website because, uh, Yo, what's up, Ron? I mailed off uh, your cards today, so they should be on their way. All the art that people has have been buying has been really helpful in my situation, because as you guys all know, I lost my job because of this, this uh, quarantine scenario. So, you know, it's... Uh, Moving forward and moving into doing art full time has been like the new thing. And uh, yet we had a, like a really good day. I mailed off like nine prints to yes uh, this morning. Nine uh, nine prints, Ron set, and then uh, some more uh, and a uh, garbage pail kids uh, wrestler set. So all that helps in paying bills and getting the new art thing going. Yeah, I'm glad you like it. You like those cards. Adam Adam Goldberg really wanted to buy that uh that uh TV version of him. I told him that it was a commission and then he said, "Oh, I bet it was Ron. It was Ron, wasn't it?" So, that was funny. He totally knows who you are. So, we're doing he manny here. We're going to have him looking up to the right. Castle of Grey Skull time. It's largely going to be an upper body shot. But we'll do like the Castle of Grey Skull effects and everything. So we can show off his fabulous powers. Yeah, that looks pretty good. For some reason, he has just one tooth. I'm guessing that's just a 
give He-Man a derp face. Not sure who drew this original card. Maybe Gross or Luis Diaz. Looks like one of them. All right, let's see. Get some muscle action going here. It's funny to see part of a pectoral muscle on a garbage pail kid. Don't usually see buff garbage pail kids. Kinda looks like a little kid version of Faker, the He-Man robot. And then I'll have free time for a second sketch after I get this one done. Guess I'll have to see which one that might be. See what I feel up to drawing or if anybody wants to get a commission today, they can hit me up and I can draw one for them. It's weird, like, uh, I'm like, that's not how that muscle hooks up on this, on this original thing. I'll just do it the right way. If my anatomy is bad, I'm just gonna be like, ah. Now that looks like a shoulder pad. Getting to the sword hilt in a minute. I think one of my things is bubbly fingers. big I gotta be careful with those sometimes they just uh, bulge a bit yeah that's not too bad Castle Gray Skull in the background here. All right, let's look that over really quick. All right, we're gonna do fix a few things. What up, Chris? How's it going, man? Sorting some GPKs. Nice. I know, I gotta make some time to sort mine. I was getting my shelf all spruced up last week. Just didn't have time to finish. This yellow is much lighter than He-Man's hair, so it's basically a base coat. I'm gonna go over it with like a dark yellow slash light orange. That'll be more the He-Man color that like everybody knows. Let 
There we go. And I was like running errands last minute, and it's like, oh shoot, it's 3.55. I gotta get set up, I gotta get some water, yada yada. What up, man? How's it going? There we go, some He-Man hair. Yeah, I'm starting to wonder if I should close the window when I do these to get more of a natural light thing. Yeah, see, it varies when you get natural sunlight. Eating a chip for a second. All right, here we go. Yeah, I didn't really have a big lunch or yeah, I forgot to eat breakfast today. Uh, so I'm like snacky. This skin tone is a lot lighter than it'll be in the end. Just doing a base coat like I did earlier. There we go. It's looking pretty good. What color is that? Um, this is a uh, basically it's like a really light um, peach. When it dries, it's gonna be like you know base color. It's like the one I do the base skin color. Like I said, it's just gonna be there for background. In the end, he's gonna look like really tanned. He's gonna look really tearing, you guys. Yoke. He's gonna be yoked. Yeah, see how the flesh tone looks a little pinker than usual today? It's because of the window open so big. There we go. Yeah, this one's going to take a lot of shades for it to get to where it's going to go. So we're in early days here. Yeah, I'm trying to get everything I can out of this set of markers before I start on the new ones I bought. Thankfully, they seem to be cooperating. Uh, no, it's a Garbage Pail Kid version of He-Man.
This was a commission for someone. I don't even know where you would get John Candy from this one. We're just going through a lot of uh, layers of colors till we get to where we're gonna go. What it up? Some more people piling in here. Yeah, I like how that's coming out. A lot of pink. <laughs> Now we'll do some eyes. some work on the hair and then we're gonna go over that with some more brown Working on the hair. It's fun, but it can be tedious. Working on the head some more. Let's tighten up those eyes. At some point. <laughs> Uh, 
I want to make those eyes a little darker. Here we go. Yep, that's coming out. All right, that looks good. Yeah, so it just takes a while to kind of get where you want to go. Do some outlining here. There, that's not too shabby. All right, let's get uh, some more skin tone over here. Eek. All right. I have never drawn this character before. The he man -y. I actually don't know if I've ever drawn He-Man before. Possibly. It's fun. All right. He's so buff, you guys. Had so many of these He-Man swords when I was a kid. The little one he's holding. The I have the power sword. I liked the Thundercats one that turned into a tiny little dagger. Sword of Omens. Give me sight beyond sight. There we go.
working on the little girdle or what would you call that harness Finishing up here. And then we'll do orange here. There we go. Almost done. Whoa. All right. Finishing this up. like how the first time you draw a character, it's always kind of a learning experience. I'm like, there's a few things I would do differently here. But, you know, it is what it is. It's coming out all right. You know, the important thing is when you're doing stuff and sometimes you feel like, oh, it's not 100% how I envisioned it. You know, keep working at it because it'll you can still get it to a place that works. The whole trick is to just not get discouraged if it doesn't match the picture in your mind's eye. Up, oh, good luck. Stay safe. Because, yeah, this looks cool. It's just not how I was picturing it to come out. That's good. Still came out rad. And the next time I draw them, it'll all uh, know to work a little bit on some things that uh, I didn't like about this version. There we go. Yeah, 
Yeah, it looks good. My thing is, I feel like I went a little too color forward on it. Like, I should have let more light into the face. Which is, like, a big... It's a nitpick, you know? But usually I don't like to, uh... Go so aggressive with the color on the actual face. And some people actually might disagree with that and say I didn't, I, I go way too light, but you know, it's all down to preferences. I'm gonna do some Kirby crackle. Like he's about to, I have the power, you know? Oh, that's good. And see, this is a clear reason of why sometimes what you're picturing, if you let go of that control, you come up with something with a better idea. Because I wasn't actually thinking of doing this with the color pen, but I think that's working out really good. And yeah, I like that. It actually came out way better than I thought it was going to. Let's get the signature on there. So you guys are like, why does the card slide? It's because uh, my new sketch cards don't have as much uh, sticky or uh, as much color on the back so it doesn't transfer to the chipboard and get stuck like the other ones did and also my drawing area is at a slant but yeah there we go he manny i like how the uh lightning came out there it's one of those things again where the car looks a lot better in real life than it does you know in the thing Yep, it is now 4.37. Um, I could draw something else if somebody wants to get a commission done. Or like, or uh, we could just call it a day today. I don't know. What do you guys want to do? I'm eating a chip for a minute. What up, Charles? Where's he, Manny? Hanging out. Does anybody have a commission or something they'd like to get done? <sighs> Excuse me. I'm drinking my cucumber water again. Yeah, fun fact, it has now been over two months since I've had any soft drinks. So, since I don't drink soda anymore, I'm doing funny things with my water. I am uh, flavoring my water with stuff like uh, cucumbers. So today I'm having a nice big liter of cucumber water. <sighs> you 
you like my refreshing sound effect? All right. I'm trying to think if there's a character I'd like to draw. Boop, do, 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 do. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll go on live later. Like, and uh, sketch something. Might go on live later. Mm. Like, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. I might just come on live later. And, uh, I'll just call it an early day on this one. Um, I think uh, the rest of the week is going to be free draws. So I'll have to come up with a little list of fun ones to draw and talk about while I do it. Since this was my last uh, commission. I have some sketch covers, but I don't think they're um, commissions I need to do. But they're not really uh, um, live stream friendly since like they're so big. I can't get them to fit on my camera. I might have to come up. I have like a... Um, what do you call it? Um, tripod. I might have to start practicing with that. So maybe for next time. But yeah, I'll come back on later. Um, I'll talk to you guys then. If not, I will. I will be back online tomorrow at four. And uh, I also have a, a Misty Bus live sketch. It's gonna go live at six on my YouTube channel. I drew it last week. And that's going to, uh, if you missed it, it'll go live on the YouTube channel at youtube.com slash C slash cult classics. But yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys. Um, I said I'll come back on later and do some doodling. Uh, you guys stay safe. If I don't see you later, I'll see you tomorrow. All right, bye.